Now you can see some brush-tailed fascigales here. They were once widespread in Australia, but now they're listed in several states, including Victoria and New South Wales, as a threatened species. Fascigales have a number of threats. These include introduced predators such as cats and foxes, the loss of habitat through urbanisation and uh, farming has had a great impact. Climate change is going to have a potential impact on their distribution. But one of the biggest impacts to this species is the loss of natural tree hollows. In this video, you can see a typical brush-tailed Fascagale forest. This is near Bendigo. This is one of my study sites. And as you can see, there's not many large old trees that are going to provide tree hollows for this species. One of the ways that we can learn about the types of hollows that fascigales need is by tracking them with radio collars. So I've been capturing fascigales from nest boxes and also catching them in Elliot traps. This unhappy fascigale has just been collared. They're actually really tricky to handle and they can give you a really nasty bite and draw blood very easily. Okay. Notice the big beautiful black bushy tail on this one. I radio tracked this female for five months. Not all releases went to plan. Oh! <laughs> she jumped out of the box. Never mind. She's up the tree. Here's just a couple of photos that I took of fascigales while I was radio tracking them at night. You can see the whip antenna hanging out the back. Now, I didn't take a lot of footage while I was actually tracking animals during the day, but this was one quite interesting sight. This female fascigale had traveled about 70 meters from the nearest trees along the ground to get to this tree. And it was one of the largest old trees in the area. And, and um, she potentially chose this tree because of the, the very large hollow that was in the the branch that had fallen off. I did actually find scat around the entrance of that hollow. And here we are, after five months having her collar removed. Must have been a relief 